Hi everyone, my name is Ray Prakash and welcome to second class of number series. So here we'll practice your problems on number series. Okay, just see this uh, questions. So for you should have, for every question you should first give a try. Okay, there are two questions in this screen. Pause the video for five minutes. Give a good try to these two questions and then see the solution. Okay. Now for now we'll solve it. For now we'll solve it. Okay. Now see here. Okay. So three nine thirty two one fifty three one zero eight zero something is happening here, right? What is this number? What is this number? So first thing to mind it should come is it's a multiplicative series, right? Multiplicative series. Why? Because series is increasing very fast. Increasing very fast, right? So three nine thirty two one fifty three ten thousand eighty. So this is increasing very fast series, right? It's a, something is getting multiplied. Okay. So from three to nine. Okay. From three to nine. What is getting multiplied? It would be into three, right? Or it could or it could be into two plus three. Again, I don't know, right? Multiplied means okay, but I don't know because three into three is also nine. Three into two plus three is also nine. So we don't know, right? So it's a bit confusing here. Let's move to next term. Nine to thirty two. What is getting? What is getting multiplied here? So nine to thirty two what into three plus five is one way. Nine into three twenty seven plus five thirty two. Or second way is into four minus four, right? Nine into four thirty six minus four thirty two. So this way two ways we can get to thirty two. Okay. Now next move to next one. Thirty two to one fifty three again. Nearest multiple of thirty two near uh, near one fifty three one fifty three is what? Thirty two into five is one sixty. So thirty two into five is one sixty. So it is into five minus seven. Okay, into five minus seven, or you can also see that it is into four plus twenty five. So by now I think you got the pattern right. You got the pattern here. You see it is into five plus into three plus five into five minus seven. Now one fifty three to ten eighty. Right. If you solve it. So one fifty three. Uh, it is, it is. This is into three. This is into five. So next should be into seven. Huh. So one fifty three into seven. One fifty into seven. Ten fifty. Three seven zero twenty one. That is ten seventy one plus nine. So it is into seven plus nine. You got the logic here now, right? You getting it? Into three plus five. Into five. So it is five. This five becomes seven. This seven becomes nine. So two two increasing. Ordinarily plus minus. Plus, so next should be minus, right? Next should be minus, and into three five seven. So it should be into nine minus and five seven nine. This should be eleven. So it should be into nine minus eleven, right? So now can you get the first one also? You can get the first one also by by this side. But the first one should be it is into three into five into seven into nine. So first one should be what? It should be into one. Okay, into ah uh, three into two plus three. Okay. So it's a bit difficult, says right. You can see it here. So into three, into three plus five. So now you can try to get the first number. Right? What is the first number here, right? What could be the first number here? You have to see it. So see, you could, you could, you could uh, make a something like this. See, uh, what you should do basically here is uh, making this number as okay. Now see here. What you can do here is, so right now you know that okay. Right now you know that. Okay, so right now you know that it is plus five minus seven. So just this should be minus three, right? Plus five plus minus plus minus. So minus minus plus minus plus. It should be minus. So it is it is minus three, right? It is minus three. And what is the next number here? So how do you get minus three? Three to nine you get minus three, right? So only way is into four minus three. So only way is. Into four minus three, right? So see here, this into four minus three. So you can see. So what is the logic going here is three into four minus three is nine. Okay, nine into three plus five is thirty-two. Okay, thirty-two into five minus seven is one fifty-three. So you can see here, right? This three and this three are same here. This five. And this five are same here. Okay, next one is one fifty three into seven plus nine. Okay, you can see again this seven and this seven are same here. It's going on like this, right? And it's alternately three five seven nine. So what is the next number? It should be into nine minus eleven. So ten eighty into nine. Okay, so ten eighty into nine is what? So ten eighty into nine. So 
थाउजेंड नाइन के नाइन थाउजेंड एंड सेवन ट्वेंटी सो नाइन्टी सेवन ट्वेंटी माइनस एलेवन नाइन सेवन जीरो नाइन इज द आंसर नाइन सेवन जीरो नाइन आई होप यू गॉट इट राइट इज नाइन सेवन जीरो नाइन ओके सो इज अ वेरी गुड क्वेश्चन राइट इज वेरी गुड क्वेश्चन कम टू नेक्स्ट वन ना वन सिक्सटी एट फोर्टी टू ट्वेल्व फोर पॉइंट वन पॉइंट सिक्स पॉइंट इट कंसिडर डिक्रीजिंग राइट इट कंसिडर डिक्रीजिंग इन and decreasing quite uniformly something is happening right so what you can do is you can instead solve for increasing it's very fine you solve for this increasing okay because always increasing is a bit easier than decreasing right it always multiply something it's better multiplying is better than dividing right so you can see here so i start from here 0.8 into 1.6 what is the multiplying factor here so you can see if if this is an if this is a number it is starting here 0.8 And it is ending at one sixty eight. Then this is increasing fast, right? Point eight, one point six is small number. Then four, then twelve, then forty two, then sixty eight, right? One sixty eight. This is increasing fastly, right? It's a multiplicative series. So point eight to one point six, two times one point six to four. How many times? So how do you get it? So you do four by one point six. That is equal to two point five. Okay, this is two point five times. Then four to twelve, three times. You got the logic here, right? Into two into two point five into three. So next should be into three point five, and next should be into four. Correct. That means so how to get point eight here? So it should be into. So you can read reverse right. Into four means divided by four. Okay, divided by three point five, divided by a uh, three, divided by uh what uh two point five. Correct. I would say right. Divide it. Ah, uh, fine. Two point five divided by two. So it should be divided by one point five. Okay. So point eight divided by one point five. It is eight by fifteen, right? It should be this. What is the answer here? Eight by fifteen. In decimal, you can a little bit of approximation. You can be around point five or more than point five, right? Little, 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 little bit more than point five. That's fine. So eight by fifteen is the answer here. You can see the options accordingly and mark the answer right. This is the logic. Okay, fine. Move to next question now. We're gonna see here two, three, seven point five, twenty six point two five, and so on. So again, you can see something is already multiplied here. Two, then three, then seven point five, then twenty six point two five. Something is already multiplied here. So you see it. How do you get from two to three? So it is into point five times, right? Because three by two is point. How to get multiplying factor? Divide ne next term by previous term. Three by two is one point five. So it is one point five. Sorry, not point five. Should write. I'm sorry. One point five times, okay. Then three to seven point five. How much it is? Three to seven point five. It is seven point five by three. It is two point five times. So got the series here, right? What is this one should be? Should be three point five times. And what is next one should be? Four point five times. Okay. So twenty six point two five into four. Twenty six into four one zero four. Point two five into four one. That is one zero five. And one zero five and Half of twenty six, right? So half point five means half of twenty six point two five. Its half is how much? Thirteen point one two five. So one zero five plus thirteen point one two five, one one eight point one two five. This is the answer. One one eight point one two five. Yeah, it is clear. Okay. Now eleven four fifteen zero nineteen minus four twenty three. Now this kind of series, right? If you see directly, this kind of series, it is not directly visible. Okay, because Eleven to four decreasing, then four to fifteen increasing, then again decreasing, then again increasing, and not in a uniform pattern also, not in a uniform pattern, right? So you can't directly get the answer. So you can observe a little bit more this kind of series, right? This is this is called this is called alternate series. This is called alternate series. Okay, alternate series. That that means something will be happening alternately, right? You see, eleven to fifteen. Fifteen to nineteen, nineteen to twenty-three. Quite easy now. Plus four, plus four, plus four. Four to zero, zero to minus four. Quite easy again. Difference is what? Minus four, minus four. Okay. So what is the answer here? So one more uh, minus four would be there. So it is how much? Minus four, minus four. It becomes minus eight. One more time, I can ask here. It will be twenty-three plus four. That should be twenty-seven. Right. Let us see this. That this alternately something is happening here. So you got to be very careful. Okay, 
and observing. So what we are doing is now we are just doing different kinds of series. We just open up our mind. Okay, this can also be asked in series. This can also be asked in the series, right? So we are just opening up our mind here. We are trying to do different kinds of sums in number series. Okay. Now again, see in this part again. Again, a good question here. See this question. Try one. Try once. One, one, three, two, four, five, six. What is the next number? I give an options here because it is a bit confusing question. Okay. Seven, eight, nine, ten. So just try it. We'll solve now. So one, one, three. Okay. And uh, this is uh, four. This is five, six. So you can see a little bit if you observe the series, right? Observation. One and one will give you two. Okay. One and three will give you four. Okay. Three and two will give you five. Two and four will give you six. Similarly. Four plus five will give you nine. So nine is the answer. Correct. So summation of this is not a Fibonacci series, right? But a kind of Fibonacci series. You can say a pattern related related to Fibonacci series, right? What is Fibonacci Fibonacci series? So Fibonacci series are what? If one plus one is two, then one plus two it's three, then two plus three it's five, three plus five it's eight, five plus eight it's thirty. It's going on like that, right? This is Fibonacci series. Okay, this is. Fibonacci series. So, this is a kind of Fibonacci series, right? Nine kind of Fibonacci series. But one plus one is two is written written as the next to next term. One plus one is not three; it is two, right? It is next to next term. One plus three is four. Again, next to next term. Okay. Two plus four, three three plus two is five. Again, next to next term. This is a bit of right. A a question derived from this. This is this question I made from Fibonacci series only. Okay. So, a very good question, right? Okay, getting from six to three, three to three, four point five, nine, twenty-two point five, and so on. Okay, so now this see this series is per first decreasing, first decreasing, and then, and then further on going for increasing. Okay, decreasing, and then further on going for increasing. Right, further on going for increasing. Okay, so decreasing to increasing. What we can say here is decreasing to increasing. So there is something right. It's it's some and you can see it's a multiplicative series also, right? It is a multiplicative series also, multiplicative. Why it's a multiplicative series? Tell me because it's increasing fast, right? Six, three, three, four point five, nine, then twenty two point five, then some number, then two thirty six point two five. So it is increasing fast, right? So but multiplying so how do you get six to three by multiplying? So six to three by multiplying. How do you get it? It's simply point five times. Okay, how do you get three to three by multiplying? It's one time. How do you get three to four point five by multiplying into one point five time? You got the pattern here. Point five, one, one point five, so on, right? So next should be into two. Yes, four point five into two is nine. Four point five into two is nine. Nine into two point five is what? Twenty two point five. Twenty two point five into three should be next one, right? So if twenty five two point five into three, how much? Sixty seven point five. Now. Again, into three point five should give me two thirty six point two five. Is correct, right? But the answer answer is sixty seven point five. Got it, right? Okay. Now this this question you can see here seventeen ninety nine point five eleven point five twenty point four five. Right. So again, a bit of something is multiplying. You can see in the formula it is because it's something getting multiplied. So this is increasing, right? Something getting decreasing then increasing. So you can see that right? again decreasing then increasing. Something related related to point five. Something related to point five multiplication. Because once you multiply by point five, series will decrease. And further on, by any multiple of point five, series will get increased. Point one, one point five, two times. Okay, so it will get increased, right? So decreasing then increasing, you can relate to bit of point five multiplication. Okay. So seventeen into point nine, seventeen to nine point five. How do I get it? Seventeen into point five is eight point five. Seventeen into point five is eight point five. So eight point five. So I would have to get nine point five. So it is plus one. It is point five plus one. Okay. Then nine point five to eleven point five. So into one. Nine point five into one is nine point five. Okay. Plus two is eleven point five. Correct. So it is got the pattern here, right? Into point five into one plus one plus two. Eleven point five into one point five next should be okay. 
and it should be plus three. Let's check it should be plus three, right? So ln 0.5 into 1.5. So ln 0.5 half is how much? 5.75. That is 17.25 plus three. Okay. 17.25 plus three becomes 20.25 and 20.25 into two plus four. Okay. It is 44.5. Okay. So 44.5 into 2.5 plus 5 should be the next one. Into 2.5 plus 5. Okay. So what is 2.5 plus 44.5 into 2.5? Okay, how much it is? Do it mentally, right? So see 44.5 into 2 is 89 and 44.5 half is 22.25. So 11 point, uh, sorry, 44.5 into 2 is 89 to it mentally, right? And 44.5 into 5, that is half of it, is 22.25. It becomes 111.25. Okay, it becomes 111.25 plus 5. 116.25. Okay, that's the answer, right? So, I hope you got it. Okay, so this is again a uh, good question on based on this 0.5 multiplication. Okay. So see, if you want to be good in this series, right, if you want to be good in this series, this series kind of questions you want to be good at, right, what you should focus is actually right now is you should have thorough, uh, you should be thorough with, okay, thorough with 1 to 100 uh, prime numbers. We'll discuss more questions, okay. You should be thorough with 1 to 100 prime numbers. Okay, how many prime numbers are there? Which are the prime numbers? Like what is the largest prime number? 97, then 89, then 83. Then 79, 73, 71, right? 67, 61. So you should be very thorough with these numbers. Then 1 to 40 squares. Okay? 1 to 40 squares. Then 1 to 20 cubes. So you should be very thorough with. Okay. At least not 1 to 20, so at least 1 to 15 should be very thorough with. 1 to 15 cubes. 1 to 40 squares, right? You should be very thorough with these numbers. Okay? So we'll continue this in the next video. Okay. Thank you.